This is it. Sam Goodall starts on the hang climb. He's not really a climber, this bloke. This is where they'll miss Zed Colback. Sam Goodall. He's working overtime here. This is very delicate, Crawf. Not sure. Oh, there's a little slip there. Alarm bells ringing for Sam. Olivia's trying to help him through and... Oh, oh! He's done that well. Now he's really got to get the lachet over. He's done it. So they're one from one WA. Sam Goodall now hands over to Olivia Vivian. She's got the body prop. OK, now you don't want to rush the body prop. 1.7 metres, the gap between the sides, and this starts to burn the whole body very quickly. That's really good, Liv. Keep it up. You've got this uphill battle. This is where it really starts to sting. Driving hard, small steps. Got to keep that body balanced. She's showing a little bit of strain on her face. Oh, look at the fear on her face. But oh, yeah. I think she's going to be OK. Sky Hattie came unstuck here for Queensland, and it's got Olivia spooked. Oh, swinging down. Don't drop those feet in the water. She does it. Hands over to boyfriend Ben Polson, and she gives a bit of a jig. <laughs> I like that. Like an Irish dancer from WA. Two obstacles down. Now all the pressure on the reigning champ. Must be perfect on the cliffhanger. You've got to realise, he's a big man. To be able to lock those fingers in like that, that is nothing but impressive. He is the first ever Australian Ninja Warrior now in the state of origin. Three obstacles to complete. Oh, he just looks so solid on every single thing he does. And there we have it. They've equaled Queensland. He's got all the time to go now. He's got the floating doors next. Arguably the most challenging obstacle on the Ninja Warrior course. He's one of the few to ever complete it. Can he do it again tonight for WA? Just needs to get the placement of that hands right. He's up nice and high on that door. Now, the only thing that will bring Ben Polson undone is a lapse in concentration. I don't expect it, but you never know. The pressure is huge in this state of origin. Big fingers around the door. Onto the last one. If he can get there without touching the water, pushes off. That means Western Australia are heading to the grand final. But this is an absolute professional at work. Ben Polson, he's already been at the top of Mount Midoriyama. Now he wants to take his state to the top. And look, Ben really studies the game and studies the guide. He'll know already. He doesn't even need to complete this, but he'll do it anyway. Can taste it, can't they? WA, they can taste it. Up he goes. Yes, Ben Polson bringing it home like the champion he is. That is just beautiful to watch. And ladies and gentlemen, get ready to give him a round of applause. Team WA. The first Australian Ninja Warrior, Ben Polson, brings it home. Five obstacles, five completes. And WA now books its place in the $100,000 showdown on the Power Tower. And it's going to take something special to stop them.